looking at the perimeter of squares and rectangles, we can actually come up with a couple of formulas to represent these. And it just means that when we're calculating the perimeter of these shapes, it can be a bit more straightforward. So take a look at this square. So the definition of something being a square is that each of the side lengths are exactly the same. So we've got 23 meters here, 23 meters here, here, and here. So we could do perimeter equals 23 plus 23 plus 23 plus 23 and get 92 meters. But check this out, we are adding 23 repeatedly four times. When we're doing some addition four times, it's the same as just multiplying by four. So this is our formula that we use for the perimeter of a square. So it says perimeter equals four lots of length. So you would write this as P equals 4L on one line, and then on the next line write 4 times, and what is the length? It's 23 to get your 92 metres. This square here, we would again do perimeter equals 4 times the length, so that is 4 times 3, giving us 12 centimetres. Okay, rectangles. So we've got 32.2 on top, which also means, because this is a rectangle, I mean it's, it's not written in here, but I'm telling you it's a rectangle, but and it looks like a 90 degree angle here, here, here and here. But this 32.2 kilometers would mean that this distance here is also 32.2 kilometers. And this 62.1 kilometers here means that this is also 62.1 uh, kilometers. Now we could do this. But again, notice we're adding the 32.2 twice and we're adding the 62.1 twice. So there's two different ways this formula can be written. We can write it as perimeter equals two lots of length plus two lots of width, or we can write it as perimeter equals two lots of length plus width added together. So this is like saying 32.2 plus 62.1, totaling that because it's in brackets and then doubling it, so times two. So for this example here, we would write P equals, uh, let's do the first one here, two length plus two width. So two times, and it's it's arbitrary which, which one of these you call length and which one you call width, but let's go uh, 32.2 plus two lots of 62.1. And it's gonna give us the exact same answer that we got before. Don't forget your units. Looking at this one down here, um, let's use the second version of the formula. So let's write perimeter equals two length plus width. And it's always a good idea to write out your formula before you start substituting in your numbers. It also means that if you accidentally substitute in an incorrect number or you type in the wrong uh, number on a calculator, you've shown exactly what you're trying to do and you can still get partial marks. So we've got two lots of 66.5 plus 33.2. So that is two lots of 99.7 and two lots of 99.7 is 199.4 and we are in meters and we should have done that check kilometers kilometers meters meters and everything else was fine but make sure you always do that check before you start because otherwise you've completely missed it or you've done all the working out and then you come back and realize that you've made a mistake Thank you.